your time. Um, and we're just going to look at a couple things. Wanted to, first of all, just see how everybody's doing. Kim's on here, but she's, she's got herself muted. So no, now she's not muted. Uh, I have cats and a dog and there's a lot of, uh, noises over here. So I don't want to interrupt, fine. but totally if fine. I have a comment, I'll, I'll jump on. But that's a good thing is you can just mute yourself and kind of see what's going on and don't worry about it too much. Okay. So I just want to go a couple of things really quickly and see who has questions. And then Susie, um, you know, gave me a suggestion of something she would like to know about. Um, and maybe that's some of the things we can start doing on these chats is just t tell me what you want to talk about. Um, Susie wants to talk about social media postings like uh, Tiny Torch and different things. Everybody has a platform that they really like. I've tried a couple of them and I've had people tell me Tiny Torch is not their favorite, but it just seems to work for me. But I'm gonna look at that in just a minute. Um, I wanted to show you, if you go over here to the March specials, some of this stuff was updated. And um, all the flyers, the March specials, but if you'll notice, they've got the, um, the gather board on there now. And in case you missed it, it didn't make the catalog because they were still trying to figure out if they could get a hold of these, and they could. So um, they are for sale starting March 1st. You can find them on the Facebook. Susie, what are you doing? Yeah. What, what do you mean, what am I doing? Can you I see can me? Hear? Yes, it's so, recording. Okay, I will, um, hold on, let me mute, sorry. That's fine. All right, so um, I wanted to tell you that I went into my, my private group and I posted these two photos and just put their back and the chatter is already like people are excited and I want to tell you some of the improvements they've made I'm not they haven't told us what the wood is I'm assuming it's the same wood um, but they have improved the um, embellishing the the etching with our first like test group we did I don't know if you guys know this but when we were testing these out in the fall they expected us to sell them through January we sold them out the stock that they had in 28 days that is how amazing these things hit it off with our customers and that was just with a select few women who are allowed to share it so imagine everybody now allowed to sell these um obviously they're going to sell faster in the fall and christmas because it's kind of a holiday looking thing but really share it mother's day um teacher's gift susie had a, a an idea for them. I forget what she said. When she pops back on here, she can remind me what she said. But these things are gorgeous. Now, the price point is high. It's $58. But when I got a hold of one, because I gave one as a Christmas gift, I didn't buy one for myself because I didn't know that they would show up this soon in our catalog. When I got a hold of one, I handed it to my husband and he goes, wow, that is good quality. I was like, it just feels like a million bucks. So $58, once they get this in their hands, they're going to love it. Now, obviously you're going to have to add the $7 for the embellishment and that embellishment, that etching is what makes it just wow. So, um, Susie, did you think of what you said was another idea for these trays? You told me something and I said, oh, good idea. And I, I should have written it down. I should have wrote, writ, written it on my squirrel list. Yeah, I, I'm so sorry, but my ideas are like then and there. It will <laughs> never come across again. Like I, I, I can't even, I'm like, I don't know. Uh, okay, so Susie and I were talking about a squirrel list. And a squirrel <laughs> list is when you have that idea that makes you kind of look and go, oh, oh, I got to do that. You know how it is? You think of something and it's like squirrel. So I should have written it on my wedding. squirrel list because it was such a good idea. Uh, but I don't have a clue. Well, maybe we can post a photo on the team page and all of us brainstorm ideas for this product. But I think it's going to be a huge selling point. Anyways, what I was saying was I booked a party like five minutes before this call off of these trays because the lady said, I want one. Can I use it as hostess reward? I'm like, absolutely. And she's like, okay, do my party. So <clears throat> sometimes you just have to share that item, that idea. And suddenly someone's just like, finally jumps in. You don't even have to ask them to party. They just want to. So all of that social media graphic is right there um, for you. All right. So I'm going to show what you. About, Go ahead. What about housewarming and wedding? Yes. I think those would be perfect. Yes. Because you could put the new last name mm -hmm. um, with, I think there's a heart on there or yeah. the possibility. Um, 
Yes. But yeah, I think wedding or housewarming um, would be perfect. Yeah, I like that. So I definitely, when we, when we, um, I'll post a photo and have everybody, make sure you throw that idea in there as well. Um, I, I know that we had a consultant who had just posted on the leading with leaders of 31 and said, boy, I, I hope these come back because I have a, co a local company that wants to buy 90 of them as, as gifts for their employees. And not a week later, they announced that they were back. So she is so excited because in March, this company is going to buy 90 of them for their employees and put their names on them. So, I mean, there, if you have, if you have an N with a business or somebody that maybe thinks their employees, and this is all Susie's brain too. She's really good at helping people thank their employees, get in there and show them these trays, host your own party. If you want to get your hands on one without spending all that money. Um, but it's, I, I can't wait to get one back inside my samples because that was one thing that people were just clawing over them. And then I was so sad when they sold out in 28 days. All right. So I got one. <laughs> okay. Uh, write it down. No, I mean, I have, I bought oh. one of you remember. So yes. I have. Yeah. And the, and the, what they improved is the etching. So it's deeper and it's going to stand out more and last longer. So, and this is a food grade product. You can serve food on it. So the rest um, of my day is ruined because now I cannot remember what I said. You, I'm going to be pining over you know it. It'll come to you. We'll, we'll share the social media graphic on our team page. If I will jump in and it'll come to you because somebody's not going to say your idea and it's finally going to hit you. Okay. So tiny yes. torch. I just want to show this to you really quickly. Right now I am using their free uh, membership. I'm probably going to upgrade. Um, because I just haven't had to upgrade yet, but I think I'm about to because I did a bunch of parties online in February and I could have used the upgrade. Cause right now, if you do the free tiny torch pass, it's only, you can only post in four different accounts at a time. So like, um, I'll show you in just a second. So I'm going to log in if I can remember my password. There it is. Okay. It saved it for me. That's a good thing. Cause I don't remember passwords, <clears throat> even though they're all the same. I still don't remember passwords. Okay, so when you log into the account, um, you're gonna prop your place that says my post is probably gonna be empty because obviously you haven't posted anything yet. When you sign up, I think that it's gonna ask you if you want to do a free trial or whatever. Try to get to the free trial and just try it out for a while. And like I said, I was talking to Susie this morning. I think I'm gonna upgrade um, just so I can do more social, more postings, you know, because they limit your post per day when you don't by the program. Okay. But I think it's, I think it's, what you say, five bucks, Susie, something like that. I'll, I'll look at it later, but I just want to show you. how to use Yes, ma'am. Okay. Just showing you how to use it. This is just a safer tool. So you're not getting um, flagged by Facebook as much for like posting too much. It just kind of protects you. And it also just keeps you like on a good timing schedule. So if you want to make sure like Shelby, you said, um, you know, you haven't had a lot of time because of the baby. This is a great tool for you because you can set up all your posts for the next week and a half and never once touch Facebook. And that would help you not to have to stress over, you know, you know, am I talking to my customers? And then, you know, it's, it's set up for you. So what you do is just go through, let's say I'm going to go up here to where it says create. And then you can only use these three options. Um, if you have a membership. So I'm just showing you the, the, the easy route for right now. So you click on there and then you're going to browse up to your, you know, find a, a picture. I'm going to go over to uh, March because I haven't posted any new stuff for March yet. So let me find my, and every time I, every time there's new pictures by month, I actually start a new folder. Um, so this is my March folder. And then I can go back and delete January and February when I don't need them anymore. So I'm not constantly building up these huge photo files. Okay. So, so let's put, let's put this. And the more photos that you can use that are yours, the better. I've been a little lazy lately. So I need to start taking some more pictures of my own stuff and adding them here, but it's okay to be lazy every once in a while. Sometimes we just have to be. So I got everything from 31. They want us to use their social media graphics. So it's not a problem. It's okay. Um, so I might put something like, uh, look who's back. And that's all I'm going to put for right now. Cause I'm probably going to post this in my events. Um, let's see. And I'll just put dot, dot, dot. Okay. So then I go down here and I put save. 
I don't put any extra labels or wording. I'm, I'm just real simple. So it's up to you if you want to put labels. Basically what this does is it puts tags on your photos. So if let's say somebody is online and they're searching and they use a certain, you know, word, they'll, it'll draw them to this photo that you uploaded. I, I don't do any of that. I really kind of don't want people searching for me. So I just leave it blank. <coughs> All right, so now my um, picture is in my, my post. So you've got create, and then you've got my post. It's so sitting there in my post. Now I'm gonna click on it again. Is everybody following me? This is good? Pretty easy. Just let me know if I'm going too fast. Um, I am recording this as well, so we can go back and look again. So now I say, okay, I've got it. Look, I like my message. So then I'm gonna hit share. And I would like to put this in um, let's say I'm going to put it in 31 catalog party with Brittany. I can either send it now. So I hit that red, that pink button and I love that it's pink, you know, 31. Um, I can send it now and it'll automatically post into that Facebook event or I can put schedule for later. I can click on here and I'd like to do it. Um, Let's see, maybe we'll do it tonight at 5.30 p.m. That's a good time. Okay, so I'm gonna do it at 5.30 p.m. I put done and then schedule. Then it's gonna show me in my schedule links. Okay, it is set up for February 22nd at 5.30 p.m. This is what we'll post. That's it, and it's saved. If I decide I don't want it, here, you move this so I can show you, I can hit cancel or if I just don't want to wait I can hit send now it doesn't matter so there's lots of options if you decided you don't want to post that you can you know just get rid of it so that's how you post Susie is that pretty easy Tammy is this just for the computer is there an app or something on your phone there is an app yes and um, yeah. it's just just look for the tiny torch <laughs> Honestly, all of my pictures are on my phone. <laughs> yes, there is a Tiny Torch app. Absolutely. Now, you might want to explore. There's um, Post to My Party. There's Sense Share. I've tried a few of them, and the way my brain works, this one works for me. You might look into Sense Share because they're all kind of the same and think, okay, I'm doing Sense Share. And from what I understand, Post to My Party allows you to set up a whole event, like one, one thing. I, you just have to decide what works for you. But I am a tiny torch girl all the way just because my brain really connects the way that I learn and the way that I digest information. It worked for me. So um, check out a couple of them. But yes, Tiny Torch does have um, a phone app, which I haven't loaded to mine yet because all my photos are on my computer. I do, I do sit down and create files of photos. So it works for me. Um, I, I have all kinds of different... Um files in my phone with Perfect. 31 specials, 31 Perfect. games. So yep. yeah, they're and, all on my this, phone. Yep. You can do it on tiny torch. Now let me show you how to add to social media. So, um, I'm actually going to, let's see, before I do that, cause I want to get rid of something. I'm going to go to my post and I'm going to, let's see. Actually, yeah, I'll just, I'll just show you how to do social media accounts. All right, so social media accounts, add or remove social accounts. Okay, so I got to move this again because it is my way. I am done with um, hostess of the month with Rebecca. So I'm actually going to go here and I'm going to delete it. So that's deleted. But then I want to add a new party. So I'm going to go down here and I'd like to get this party from, you know, you can see all the choices. I'm going to get it from my Facebook event. It's going to give me all the Facebook events that I'm part of. Um, past, future, all of that. So let me go to, I'm going to add this party that I just booked. So fun with Christina. Now it's added to my list. So then when I go back to my post, I got to keep moving this out of the way. We go back to the post. Let's see. Um, what's something I can post on hers real quick. Let's start with this one just for fun. So I'm going to go to here. I'm going to click on, I can do all four of them, but I think I'm just going to do fun with Christina. And then I'm actually going to go ahead and just put send now. 
So it takes just a few seconds. It's, it's pending right now. So I think it has about a 60 second delay. So let me go back to scheduled posts and it is done. So now I'm gonna go over to Facebook. Let me go to events. And you can see what it looks like on that end. And the good thing is you don't have to choose an event. You can choose a group or a page. It doesn't matter. Um, you know, you can post the same, it, you post the exact same way. So here's the party that I just posted to. And this is my cousin. She won't care that I'm doing this. <laughs> she won't care that I'm using her as a demonstration. So when, you, when I go to the, the party now, it's slowly catching up. It, my computer doesn't like all this stuff. Okay, so now you can see that it's there. So it looks just like I posted it. The only thing is right here, really tiny. Do you see where it says Tiny Torch? It lets people know that it was posted by Tiny, tiny Torch, but mostly people won't even notice that. They, they, they don't even know what Tiny Torch is. And so it's got what I posted and then the picture and my name. So it's pretty neat. Okay, so that is how you use your social media tools. And like I said, you can, I will I have this recording so you can come back and look at it or if you go and start playing on it and you have a question, you know, don't hesitate to call or send me a message or text and say, hey, I'm kind of stuck. Quick what question do I do with Tiny Torch. Sorry? Quick question with Tiny Torch. Okay. Um, when you were po about to post or you were adding it to um, the party, mm -hmm. it said adding a, an event for the first time, set it to public. Yeah. Do you do that? Or, I mean, are we supposed to? Because I thought groups and stuff were supposed to be closed. No, I don't set it to public because the, the event is not public. So okay. I don't have to worry about that. I don't do any events public because I don't want my, my information spamming everybody on that friends list and my friends list. Oh, right. But, I'm just saying that on Tiny Torch it says set event to public to avoid complications. Mm, now, I think that... You've never done that? So yeah, it just... No, I've never had to, and it's never been a problem. Okay, awesome. Yeah. They, they probably just want, you know, more of their stuff out just there, but I don't do that. Okay, awesome. Yeah. And I think, and Susie, if you sign up for Tiny Torch and you do the bigger membership, I'd love to hear from you how that works. Absolutely. Says, um, I, I really want to... It, it'll be at least, um, I don't know, a week or two. That's fine. That, want to get into the swing of just using tiny torch yeah every day anyway but it says with the upgrade that it just reaches more people and i'm like that's the whole point right it probably so. does it probably does and it's because tiny torch knows all the algorithms they know the science behind yes and um yeah so that's that's what it is so um but not only that but they once you put in your tagline 31 gifts mm -hmm. um once you put that because you have to put your you know wh what is this for mm -hmm. um then they start pulling 31 gifts photos for you mm -hmm. so all you have to do is you know say monthly special and they go and pull the pictures for you so yeah, you don't even yeah you don't even have to go ahead you, you don't even have to you know, worry about what updated photos you have. They'll do it for you for, yeah. I think it was five bucks. It might have been like eight bucks, but I really think it was five. Okay. Yeah. Just let me know. And, and it's no hurry. I'm, I'm okay with my membership for right now, but I think I will have to upgrade it. Cause I think I would like to make it post for me and my groups. And other pages that I, I'm not always consistent on. So yeah. And it is nice because sometimes I'll just sit down. I'll sit down like on a Friday and set up all my posts for the next solid week. Right. And it's just a matter of making sure I, you know, answer questions or comments from customers. Right. And that, it's, it, does, it does save a lot of time. Um, it is, it's been a, a, a lifesaver for me. I know that um, Carrie from Pampered Chef uses posts to my party. That she swears by it. Again, like I said, maybe just try a couple of them because all of them have free trials. See what your personality <laughs> Um, I don't even know what other companies there are to try. There's post to my parties, cinch share, C I N C H share. 
and there's one more I have to look it up, but the most popular one is uh, post to my party. Okay, I don't, I'm sorry, I don't know what happened, but right after you said the first one, you went completely down. I didn't hear a word. Okay. Yeah, um, can, you, you glitched. Can you hear me now? <laughs> can you hear me now? Yes. <laughs> okay. Um, I said it was post to my parties, cinch share. I, that word is hard for me to say. It's C I N C H share. And then um, tiny torch. There is a glitch. There's a glitch on my computer. It's just, it's kind of bouncing on me. Okay. Okay. Um, another one I saw that um, Heather Stambro started using is Postcron. Oh, O S T C R O N. Okay. And I think she has like a blog post. Oh, on it, I think too. So that's a new I one. I haven't looked into it too much, but she was she was excited about it. I think what made me loyal to Stitch, sorry to Tiny Torch was when um, Thirty One for some reason flagged the whole company and wouldn't let not Thirty One Facebook flagged the whole company and blocked all of us from posting through Tiny Torch. And you know, no, Facebook is notorious for just not responding. Like you can have an and nobody responds. So the owner of Tiny Torch actually went to Facebook headquarters and sat out there for like two days until he fought for all of us to get our accounts back. So I was, I just, he just had my loyalty after that, you know, like he took it very, very seriously that Facebook was blocking people from posting. But it's, why were they blocking people from posting? Um, probably turf wars over all the different posters and you know who's sponsoring and who's paying in the most money and and i think it was a i think it was a, a business move i can't prove that but um i know that tiny torch sat down with them and fixed it and it was fabulous after that and they've actually gotten better since then so i just i was just really impressed by the owner for doing that um and it was like daily post and, and updating us all of his clients like what's happening, lots of apologies, no excuses being made, and he just like camped outside of Facebook until he got it fixed. So I, I don't know if there's other reasons to be loyal to a company, but I like good customer service and I thought he did a great job, so. Anyway, so if you find a good social media posting group that you like better, please share with the team, because like I said, there's gonna be some girls who don't respond well to, to, to um, Tiny Torch. It may not be a good platform for them. So if you find something you like better, definitely share on the team page. That'll be good. So let's see what time it is. It is already 1225. Um, does anybody have any last minute questions? And then we'll post some photos of the trays and everybody can share their ideas. Anybody? No? Okay. Well, I appreciate you getting on. I was like a little nervous that my first coffee with the team, there would be nobody on it, but this is great. So um, I have the other date set and I'll remind everybody when the next one is. And if you have an idea we can talk about, hi Veronica, she snuck on there with us. Um, let me know and then we can discuss that topic. And maybe if somebody else finds a different social media platform they like, we can look at that one together. So um, I appreciate you and thanks for sharing your baby with us, Shelby. <laughs> sweet baby. <laughs> Send her a fan for Christmas. Oh, she's asleep. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, oh, sorry, baby. <laughs> <It's okay. laughs> All right, guys. Well, I appreciate you joining me and uh, hope you have a, a strong end to your month and keep booking those parties for March. We'll talk to you soon.